Here it goes. <sighs> oh, damn. And it's so much harder to... Hold your arm up, isn't it? Oh my god, yes. Oh my god. This is gonna be so huge. <sighs> oh my god. That's tight in there too, mm -hmm. right? Oh, it sounds like an alien. Ah. Do you feel the stretch? Mm -hmm. Oh. It's just so much looser. <sighs> and you can almost see this tension up here. Damn. Oh. Got it. It's just instant relief. So now I'm gonna push into your sacrum. Unlock your full potential at Crack Addicts. So we have Kat here today. Um, what do you want to work on? What's your, um, what's your spots? My neck and my mid back have okay. been bothering me a lot. All right. We're going to start with that actually, okay? Because oh, okay. I want to do that first. Okay. But before we do that, I'm going to have you lie face down. I just want to okay. test your neck. Okay. So you're going to put your nose here. Okay. Do that. And I'm going to just have you turn your face left and right, left and right, so you can just see the difference, okay? Okay. So that's center. Now turn to the right, and now turn to the left. Which one's harder to do? To the left. Okay. Back to center. Move it closer. So here, actually scoot down all the way towards until your feet are just about at the edge. Good. And lift your head up so we can pass this through. And now push your hair through now. Pull your hair through me. Good. And then I'm just going to tilt this back just a little bit. so. Stretches. Do you feel the stretch? Mm -hmm. Good. Big breath in and blow it out. Big breath in. Oh my god. Oh, I felt amazing. What did you experience? Amazingness. <laughs> my whole neck cracked, my did upper back. Yes. How far down did it pop? I would say like the lower back. All the way to the lower back? Yeah. That's crazy, that's really good. So now I'm gonna come in, come all the way up here, Adriana. <laughs> Drop your head. Oh. It was a thing, I was right, there was one more. Lie face down. Big breath in and blow it out. Good, now I'm gonna have you lie on your back. Okay. So you're gonna be on this section. Let me take, and now move closer to me though. A little closer, a little closer. Perfect, so I'm gonna take your wrists and crisscross them like this. Put your face all the way to this side. All the way to this side. Good. Now lie on your side facing me. You take your hand and pull it through. You know, just right in here. Got it. How's that one? Good. Now come all the way to this side. Scoot your hips towards me. Good. Let this go straight. Shoulder through. Hold on here. Got it. Line your back. Legs out straight. And adjust into the ankle. Okay. Wow. Everyone, watch this. Got it. Come stand up, cat. Let me see your arms, okay? Good. 
Here, face me a little bit. Turn around a little bit more. They're, they're good. Perfect. All thank right, you thank so you. much. Thank you. How is that? Do you feel a little looser? Amazing. How's your neck yes. feel now? It feels great. Now, shoulders are absolutely so tense. I have a very bad spot right here in my traps. My traps are extremely tight and my lower back, I just feel like it needs to like stretch out. All right, we're going to try doing all that. Touch your toes for a minute or get close. So that's you have a pretty good range of motion. Yeah, I do. Do you feel tightness in your lower back when you Absolutely. do that? Absolutely. Without so, a doubt. So now you're touching there. Reach back and touch where in your back you feel it at the same time. Okay, so she's pointing here. Turn around and then stand up so we can see. So she's pointing. Uh, turn this way. So you're feeling right in there, Absolutely, right? Absolutely, yeah. Okay. A little higher, too. So. And, and up through yeah. here. So this whole, all the quadratus lumborum bilaterally, she's feeling it up and down right through here. Um, so now lean back. So if you lean back, does that catch your back at all too? Yeah, oh, um, big time. Which is worse, going forward or going back? Forward. Now I'm God. digging my finger into the upper left area. I'm approximately at C2, the second cervical vertebra. Do you feel that right there? Oh, yes, I do. Now on a scale of 1 to 10, 10 meaning that really hurts. 10. <laughs> okay, that's a 10. Just shout out an answer if you have yep. one. <laughs> you said 10. Sorry. <laughs> no, it's good that you did. Like right there, right? Yeah, where, even if, yeah. Okay, sorry. So it, it makes my shoulder just collapse. Well, okay. So what if you reach up? Uh-huh. You have range of motion though, right? No, I have range of motion, but it 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 goes with much... Uh, so that's, what number is that? Oh, where that's, my thumb is? that's definitely a 10. Okay, sorry. <laughs> no, no problem. Now turn your head all the way this way and all the way this way. Which way is it harder to turn? Um, I I don't know if there's that much of a difference. I do feel some pulling here. Okay. So I'm going to turn your head all the way this way. I'm going to reach under with my palm. And tilt, 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 tilt. Stay loose. Big breath in. Blow it out. Ah, oh. oh. oh, that felt amazing. And really drop the arms so they really drape. Beautiful. So these are some of the other trigger points you have around the rhomboid major, the rhomboid minor. Is that under the under the, like the shoulder blade? Yeah, like if I bring your arm back here, give me this arm and put it behind you and let it rest there. And then I can really get under the shoulder blade. See, there's the shoulder blade there. But I don't feel we need to because it's just going to put more. Um, I want you to stay as relaxed as possible while I hit these horrible spots. Okay. Like they're easy to find on you. I don't have to put your arm behind <laughs> you to, to locate the, the one bad spot under your shoulder blade. For you, they pop out everywhere. They're so easy to see. Because they're so bad? Well, yes, <laughs> they are pretty bad. <laughs> so turn your face this way so I can hear you better. Okay. And you're going to sweep, may I take your hair off? Sure, yeah. Okay, or you can help me. Thank you. Mm -hmm. That's enough. Mm -hmm. And then just lay your head there. So this way when we talk, I'll fix your tag too. Is that okay? Yeah, that's fine. I'm sorry. Coming down the back. Coming down the back. Good. That's tight in there too, mm -hmm. right? Oh my god. Sorry. That was a bad. <laughs> what do you think of that? Oh god, that felt so it's just instant relief. It's absolutely instant relief. Big breath in. And blow that out. I even feel just so much more relaxed. Is that fine? Yep. I'm going to pull on the skin because I think this will be relaxing for you, okay? okay. Strange, but okay. relaxing. <laughs> so I'm going to pull the skin up like this. Okay. And this you can come in really close to see this. Oh. Oh my God. What happened? I just felt just a, uh, uh, like a pop. Okay, let's do another one, all right? 
Nothing. Nothing. Ah. Oh. oh my God. <laughs> what 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 exactly was that? Well, it's really pulling on the fascia. May I do one more? Oh, sure, sure. Okay. So I'm going to try to grab just right above L4. Oh my god. It feels it feels so much better. Good. It's so much different than than how I just walked in here. Nice. Now here's your hammies. Do you feel this right there? I do. That should hurt a little bit. Yeah, it does. And I think that's a spot. Yeah, that? definitely a spot. <laughs> Now, if I bring your legs up like this, mm -hmm. does that bring on any tightness in the spine? Yes, I was just going to say that. Okay. Yep. Like right in there. Right? Um, I would say a little higher. Higher. Yep, yeah, right there. Okay, good. Thanks for letting yep, me know. Yep, right there. So I think what's happening is she's pointing to L4, and when I bring the legs up, the pelvis pitches forward, and it puts more pressure on L4. But since we're missing a little space there because of deadlift squats, all the power lifting that you do when you're working out like that, um, we need to open that up. And when we do, it won't pinch. Okay. So I'm going to have you lie on your side facing me, okay? Who wants to do that? So here's L5, but I'm going to come up to L4. Actually, I might even do it like this. So I'm going to put my hand through, okay? Okay. So here's five. And there's four. Yeah, that's, that's the four. That's the one I want, right? Absolutely. That's the tender one. You feel the difference between four yeah, and five. Yeah, five feels relaxed. Yep. Four feels like a brick. Absolutely. Ah! Uh, uh, that felt that felt amazing. I'm so sorry. That felt so good. 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 So let's do the other one, okay? I'm going to stay on L4. I'm just going to really oh get it moving. Then we're going to recheck the leg test, okay? Sure. You want to do another one? Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to put my arm through, if I may. Yep. Let's get on that spot again. Hop your legs forward a little bit towards me. There you go. It's already going. Yeah, it's already going. There we go. Oh, my God. Nice. That felt... Absolutely amazing. You and feel it already. Yeah, it's <laughs> already, it already softened up. So it yeah, should be you, a lot less. You feel it. Or it it's yeah. Not even, it's non existent. Yeah, so that's good. That's what we want. And the legs are even. Now you're going to lie on your back when we do a Y strap on sure. you, okay? And that is going to decompress it a little bit. Well, let's try this first. Sit up. Let me lower the table. Put your arm out to the side like this. Mm -hmm. Make it strong. Good. Now I'm going to add compression to your head. Okay. So here's the compression. Now hold your arm strong. It's hard to do that, yeah. right? What we're going to do is we're going to secure your legs so you don't slide across the table when I work on you, okay? okay. May I I'll tie this up yeah. with the Velcro? Sure. Okay. And then I'm going to... Make it nice and firm. Sure. And you're going to help me pass this behind your head so it doesn't catch your hair at all. And sweep yeah. your hair away, yup. Yeah. So your hair's not in the way at all today. <laughs> so first I'm going to let you experience the stretch to make sure it's not slipping off the back of your head. Mm -hmm. Does this feel okay for you? It feels fine. So what I do at the very end is I do a tug. Okay. So big breath in, blow it out through your mouth. Oh my God. <laughs> wow. It's just so much looser. It's just so much looser. I don't feel like I even have that pain on my trap. It's just, I could finally touch it and it feels loose. It wasn't that agonizing pain when I first came in here. Wow. Wow. Big breath in. 
cobra. Ooh. Oh my god. I didn't even know all this was possible. <laughs> That feels absolutely amazing. Oh my god, this feel amazing. I'm gonna pull a little on the leg now, okay? okay. You ready? Mm -hmm. okay let's do this leg. Did you feel your ankle pop? I did, there? yes yeah. I did. <laughs> Absolutely. That one didn't go. I'm gonna contact a little higher. Sure. Oh yeah, that I felt. Good. Definitely. I think the toes are good. A little bit. So why, why is that important to feel your ankle? Like... Well, because you do a lot of um, lifting and probably burpees and... Yeah. So you're compressing your ankles. Got I just it. want to make sure they're open. Got it. Okay. Because we need the ankles to be a shock absorption. We need the ankles and the knees and the hips and the lower spine to absorb shock. And if they don't, they compress, they get tight. Understood. They uh, stay in a constant state of stress and that makes you feel bad. Got it. So I'm always looking for areas where stagnation, with compression, mm -hmm. with stress, and I try to make a difference. This, this thumb I did have um, surgery on. So we're going to leave that alone. Or a ligament there. I'll leave that. I won't won't make that the project today, okay? Yeah. Oh, so, I felt crack there. A little crack there. So sit up. Let's check that compression again, okay? So remember when I pushed down on your mm -hmm. head. So we've already released it with the Y strap. So to make this arm strong, good. Now I'm going to add the compression. Oh, day and night. Day and night, right? Day and night. Because I opened that up. Wow. Yeah, that, that's, that's the spot right there, I know. Turn your face this way, so she can see your face. That should kill her, right? And it's, it's a bad pain, it's a real killer. Actually, that's a little too much. <laughs> <laughs> Come in very close. <laughs> Damn. Did you hear that? Yeah. <laughs> Jesus. So when I do that on um, my YouTube channel, people think I'm faking it. That's not fake. <laughs> no, now we have a powerful microphone, so it'll even sound louder. Yeah, it probably like sounds crazy loud on high-end high microphone. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but it probably that, sounds crazy loud on But that was pretty loud. Yeah. No microphone. Yeah. And you heard that on video. Yeah, easily. What days do you work? Six days a week. Which day is your off day? It's Sunday. Come sit up for a second, okay? And you're gonna have your back to me, so you're gonna sit on the chair right here. I'm gonna love watching your video. Come around this way. Okay. That's the one underneath. Did you hear a crack? Yeah. yeah. Okay. So now lie on your back. Oh, I can't wait for this one. <laughs> this is a good spot here. 
somewhere in here where you can walk around and do whatever you want. Mm -hmm. So before we start, I'm going to stretch you a little bit, okay? It's going to be big, Andre, okay? <laughs> okay, we're going to do a real one. Big breath in and blow it out. Good, one more. Big breath in. Blow it out. <clears throat> oh, damn. How do you feel? <laughs> what do you feel? Do you feel all the way down? I feel it all around my neck. There's more. Now come in for a super close up. Oh. <laughs> Shit. Oh. Ah. Uh, oh, it hurts right now. Let's do the other side. I'll balance it out. Yeah. Let it drop. Oh. Can you believe all that shit? No. Come down this way a lot. Do that. You okay? Yeah. All right. Let's give him a chance to. Relax. Okay. Where does it hurt? The muscles or? Yeah. All right. Let me rub them out. Here. So just stay down there, and you can come close to me now. Come up this way. <laughs> yeah. yeah, you did. But you had like, well, you had like ten years of. Stress in there. Yeah. Probably more. Maybe more. All right, drop your head. There you go. I'm sorry if it was too much for you. But guess what? You needed it too. Oh, yeah. Even if you're a little sore for a day, yeah. on the I other know. side, you're going to have all the room in there. It was all, all the bones were stuck. They were like pushed together. They shouldn't be like that. Like they shouldn't be compressed. Yeah. You're living your life with compressed bones. Every day you work with bones that are stuck, stuck on top of each other. Mm -hmm. And you get used to it a little bit, but it's not healthy. No. So I took every bone and opened them up. Look, they were like this. And I went, oh. Yeah. And that freaked you out a little bit because your bones have not been. And the muscles they haven't been stretched too. Yeah, they, they, the muscles and the bones haven't been. Um, like released in 10 years maybe since your guy did it in back home on the yeah that was, more, that was more than 10 years ago. yeah but and just because you get used to something like someone could go yeah i'm used to walking around like this but it's not healthy no. right mm -hmm. I heard that was that. his shoulder. It felt also like the back. So back, like shoulder, uh, shoulder blade. Yeah. That was mm. this bone. You're very interesting, Andre. I know. You have <laughs> shit everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> oh! oh. <laughs> that was another big piece. That was in the middle of his back. Yeah. More. Just. Now, lie on your side facing me. Oh, I, I want to see this so one. Stand up again. You have to work harder, Athena. Don't get busy. <laughs> okay, my cinematographer's sitting down. <laughs> what the fuck? This is going to be so huge. I'm it's excited. It's going to be like biblical. I'm excited. I don't even know that word, but. <laughs> That's his lower back that's been bothering him. So no wonder your lower back's been bothering you. Those bones were fused. Can I turn your head? Yeah. Keep it that way, okay? Big breath in and blow it out. His whole body shakes. Do you see yeah. it? Yeah. Because that's, that's not, he can't control that. That's uh, like a nervous system reaction. His whole nervous system is freezing. He's even being so confident. Yeah. He's been through a lot. Yeah. Like we're joking around, but it's no joke. Like we're joking because he loves this and he was excited. And mm -hmm. I joke because I think the pops are fun. Mm -hmm. But the no joke part is he's really experiencing some crazy shit right now. Yeah. 
he's really feeling like like energy fly through his body. Yeah. His whole body is shaking almost uncontrollably, like he is shivering almost. And so he's really experiencing intense central nervous system unloading. I think he's been wound tight for over 10 years. Yeah. And I dealing with that. horrendous stress. And you might feel a lot of stuff. You might feel like laughing. You might feel like crying. You might feel yeah, like getting literally, that's yeah. what I feel. Like, I want to cry. I feel like I want to like laugh. You might be hungry. You might lose your appetite. Like it's all normal. I hope this is as good as your wrestling coach. Yeah, honestly, that was. Can't compare right now because I'm gonna tell you straight up. When he did it, I, it was cracks, no pain. Yeah. When he just did it, like, it was yeah. intense. It was really right. intense. I mean, this is more intense, you know? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I'm um, also, uh, you're also 10 years older. Yeah, yeah. And not only 10 years, but like. And I'm not doing you're like, like I was doing You're like before. 40 years older. <laughs> yeah, but you also gotta right. think about. I used to exercise every right. day back so the then. Exercise, so. You know, the exercise burns off the stress, so you accumulate stress, but then the exercise smooths everything out. I just put myself on the spot because if I don't make a difference, then when we stand up and recheck that arm test, it won't make any difference. But maybe I can get to it, okay? Yeah, so this is all tight in here. So besides the trap, I think it's referring to the trap from the cervicals. So do you feel how this is tight too, right up in here? Mm-hmm. And yeah. under here? Oh my God, yes. Yeah, so I think that's some of the source or the origin or the cause is this upper cervical area. Oh my God, it's so sore. Yeah, and let's stretch this away a little bit. Now there's a big adjustment that we do on that where we kind of hug the top of the head and lift up. It's called an occipital lift. Have you ever seen me do that on YouTube? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Does that seem frightening or is that something you're open to try? I'm open to try. Okay, because it would really get this spot. Yeah. All right, we're going to do that next. You're going to come sit up. I'm almost like sweating because like when you're... Well, it's intense. Yeah, that pressure yeah. point. And what she's feeling is that the sympathetic nervous system... Why here, so you're going to scoop forward. And actually put one leg on this half and one leg on that half and then scoot forward a little bit. So the sympathetic nervous system interacts with the parasympathetic nervous system. So if the sympathetic nervous system, that's your fight, flight, fright part of your nervous system, the, the hypervigilant part of your nervous system, and it's irritated right now. Then as I start to massage into it, this, the parasympathetic nervous system kicks over a little bit and you're getting a little bit of a body sweat. You're feeling like you can get uh, an adrenaline shift. Uh, so your body really does react. If we looked at your pupils, we might see a change in dilation of the pupils just by working on some of these spots. Here, let it collapse against me. Oh my God. <laughs> what was that? That was a big crack. Yeah. Oh boy. <laughs> wow. It was awesome. <laughs> I'm like, sweating and laughing at the same time. I, I feel like I want to burst into laughter. I laughing. couldn't believe how much that was loud. <laughs> we we're going to do another one. So you're going okay. to lie on your back because okay. there's another section, but I want to do the supine. So it's a similar move. It's going to be on the opposite side, but instead of doing it seated, I'm going to switch it up and do it a different style. So I'm going to come under this way now, under this part of the occiput on the right side. And it's soft but direct. It has a different kind of pop. This one is like more, I don't know, crisp. The other one is louder. This one is like more, yeah. just like, I don't know, crisp is my definition. In a way, hold your arms strong. Nice and strong. <laughs> Back yeah. and away this way. I get strong, <laughs> right? And now let's push into this trap. And let's push into right. the other trap. Wow. So we, we, in a way, we uncrimped it or we un, it was pressured and, and yeah. irritated. So we removed that type of irritation off of it. And now you're getting a good firing into the muscle and you're able to hold a contraction without it fading because of irritation. Yeah. 
you know, and it didn't cure anything, but it sure relieved it, you know. Wow. And it might need a couple of treatments to really have lasting, sustaining effect, um, but it's a really good start. I wonder, I have a question, because I've always thought that I have a weak upper body, like just doing upper body, so maybe it's just that problem that actually helps with my upper strength. Yeah, well, it's true. I mean, like, for example, um, you might not train your upper body as much as your lower body, right? Yeah. You're doing a lot of cardio and stair masters and elliptical and <laughs> yes. things like that, right? Um, or or um, exercise classes that really have lunges and different work for your lower half. And then your petite up here, you're, you don't have a gigantic skeleton. You're tall because you're a model. It's, it's very effective to be tall. But um, so this area might take a little bit more uh, wear and tear. I could feel it's like really sore. Wow. Oh my God. When you do that. It's so... How about this one? It's the same. Same, yeah. Yeah. Sure. Oh my gosh. What is that? Well, you have. <sighs> you have both sides are tight. Can I move yeah, the what? band down two inches? Sure. Because your fifth lumbar ends right where that symbol is on your okay. uh, Lululemon. Yeah. So I'm going to move it just to here. Is that all right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Now I'm going to grab your skin and pull a little bit, okay? Mm -hmm. So come in close for this. A little bit. Here's one. <laughs> There's oh one, <laughs> and here's one down here, a little one there, and one there. Okay, that part's done. Lie on your side facing me. So you're going to put both arms on this side of the table. Actually, we're going to do a different one. I haven't done this one in a while. So you're going to put your, you hug me here with your arm. Hug you? Well, you know, keep it firm. Okay. And I'm going to grab this bone here with my fingertips. And here, give me some resistance up here. Squeeze my arm. There you go. Oh. You hear that pop? Yes. And there's one more. Oh. There it goes. Oh. That was huge. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> How many was that? That was a lot. <laughs> it was a weird sensation. Yeah, all of them yeah. released at the yeah. same time. So now you're going to mirror image to the side. We're going to get the other side, and then we'll have you recheck your leg strength or your leg mobility. I know it freaked you out a little yes, bit, but it doesn't did. it feel good in a way, too? It does. Yeah. Big breath in and blow it out. Oh! Got it. Oh, my God. That was so unexpected. Um, so now I'm going to stretch this leg to the side. I'm going to do a little pull, okay? You feel that hip pull out? Yeah. Okay. Now, take a big breath in and blow it out. Good. And one more up here. Oh. All right. <laughs> come stand up. I want to look at your wrists and thumbs, okay? Are you okay? Are you ever going to come back? I, yeah. I think I was too strong with you. Ah. Oh, there's one there. 